Ah, the horse. A beautiful, noble animal. Its amazing ability to learn, its devotion and obedience, its intelligence and ingenuity have always amazed people. The horse is a very peaceful creature. Horses build excellent relationships, both with other animals and with humans. When facing a predator, more often than not, horses simply try to get away from danger. Their natural ability to run fast it really helps out. Nevertheless, horses know how to stand up for themselves and don't hesitate to use their hooves and teeth if need be. Hey guys, welcome to our channel today. Today we get to see what these animals are capable of. So, let's see some horses in action. Just look at this goose. The horse was passing by rather calmly and didn't even turn its head in the direction of the goose. It was just walking by, wasn't bothering anybody. However, it wasn't enough for the feathered bully to simply hiss at the horse. It decided to get closer. And then, something unexpected happened. Without even turning its head or stopping, the horse delivered a precise blow with its hind hoof. Unfortunately, the feathered hisser will never recover from his injury. And here's another goose. Now, this one rushed to protect its family, but it isn't entirely clear from whom. It seems that geese are rather aggressive birds. The horse was at a distance, turned away from the goose, and wasn't even looking in its direction, but the very presence of the ungulate seemed like a serious threat to this bird, and so it decided to attack. But then it quickly got a couple of blows with the horse's hind legs. Now, this goose was luckier than the first one, it seems that it escaped only with a fright, but wasn't physically injured. Spreading its wings wide, it immediately set off to run to its own kind. Now, here's a fight between equal rivals. Now, I don't know what caused it, but one of them was very lucky not to receive a series of violent blows to its head with the hooves of its opponent. It's surprising because the victim had a better chance of winning, since no one was holding it, in contrast to the passionately fighting stallion, who was held by the bridle by a man. Fortunately, the horses were separated and no one got hurt. So these shots show two horses that came together in a brutal fight. So the fight took place in a mountain pasture. And during this fight, the horses tried to bite each other on the neck, ouch. Now, horses' teeth are one of the strongest parts of its body. And besides eating and grinding food, Horses use their teeth for grappling, attacking, and defense. Horses are large animals, and their jaws are very strong. And therefore, the consequences of such a bite can be very serious. We see how the people who ran up to the animals were trying to separate them in every possible way. Finally, they managed to do it. Fortunately, no one was hurt. Now this video was filmed on a beach. A couple of horses with riders were calmly walking on the beach along the sea. Suddenly a barking dog ran up to the horses and immediately received a precise hoof kick. I really hope this poor fellow recovers from such a blow. The force of a horse's hoof strike can reach 500 to 600 kilograms. And it's difficult to imagine a blow of such force not having consequences. Now, I don't know if this rooster was put into the horse's paddock on purpose, or if it ended up there by accident, but these two clearly didn't enjoy each other's company. Chasing one another, the animal stopped, not knowing what to do next. And then, the horse decided to run in a circle, and either it was a cunning plan, or it happened by accident, but it fell on the rooster. The feathered animal was lucky. The fall wasn't entirely accurate, and it remained safe and sound. You want another horse versus rooster video? Well, here you go. Uh, the only difference here is this rooster turned out to be bolder and launched into an attack. Of course, it immediately got kicked with a hoof, which caused it to fly off several meters. By the way, have you noticed that the horse only kicks forward or backward? That's due to the anatomical structure of the horse's legs, which doesn't allow it to kick to the side. The bold rooster did not retreat, but continued the attack, deftly maneuvering between the horse's hind legs. Now, like in any other sport, equestrian sport has its own achievements and records. 
The record is recorded by the panel of judges on the basis of the competition rules and special rules for registering records, and is approved by the official organization. The world's highest jump ever made on a horse is 2.53 meters. It was set by American Freddy Wedak on his horse, King's Own. Unfortunately, this record is considered unofficial since only 25 people came to watch this event, and it wasn't even a sanctioned competition. The official world record is 2 meters, 47 centimeters. It was set in 1949 by the Mexican athlete Morales on the horse, Huaso. Another incident when dogs barked at a horse. The horse took a defensive position, but the dogs didn't understand that and continued to bark. One deafening blow, and one of the dogs was no longer making any sounds. The poor fellow just sat there, without even moving. Just look at this beautiful creature. This is an Ardennais horse. It's one of the oldest breeds of draft horses which come from the region of the Ardennais Mountains in Belgium, Luxembourg, and France. They are broad-boned horses with thick legs used for draft work. Pulling out a stuck car is easy for this horse, as well as defeating 18 adult men in a tug of war. Moreover, it pulled them over with a clear advantage and without much straining. Now, it's unclear how this horse got downtown. The animal was clearly frightened and confused. The horse panicked and ran out into the road where it fell on a passenger car. Fortunately, the horse was fine, but the car is going to need some repairs. Here's another traffic accident involving horses. So these horses were running by the road, but couldn't get around the oncoming car. This time, the consequences were more serious than in the previous video. Not for the horse, though, but for the car. So this horse was curious about the turtle hiding in its shell. But remember the popular proverb, curiosity killed the cat, right? Well, fortunately, the horse didn't die, but it did get bitten on its nose. I don't think it's all that curious anymore. Welcome to Arabian Horse Fight Club. As you can see, they were trying to use their main weapon, their teeth. Luckily, no one got bitten. After running around a little, these horses calmed down. And this is some shocking content. This horse ate the chicken. I'm sure that it happened by accident and that the horse would spit it out when it realized that something was wrong, but it didn't happen. It just continued to chew on the poor bird. Now, as this turns out, this isn't an isolated case, and I don't even know how to explain it because horses are strict herbivores. So these shots show a small and confused foal on the road. As it turned out, it somehow jumped over the guardrail but couldn't get back. Its family was waiting for it behind the railing. It's good that it came across a kind driver. The man carried the foal over the guardrail and it finally returned to its mother. Here are some more hoof kicks with hind legs for dogs that get in the way. A shepherd dog that had been hit in the jaw ran away immediately. I hope it's fine. Now, horses are herd animals. There's always a strict hierarchy in the herd. So there's subordinates and there are superiors. Leadership in the herd isn't inherited from leader to leader, but it is acquired through the battles of stallions. As soon as a new stallion is introduced into a herd, the battles for leadership begin. Therefore, herds usually don't accept horses from other herds, so as not to destroy the already established system. The main job of the stallion leader is to protect the herd from danger. The danger can come from both predators and people, as well as stallions from other herds, which can lead their mares out of the herd. The herd leader can only be changed through the duel of two stallions. These fights look very bloody, but this is the only way to determine which horse will be able to protect the herd and pass on good genetics to the next generation. This man riding a scooter noticed a rider trying to catch up with his fleeing horse. The man decided to help by offering the services of his transport. After a couple of minutes of the chase, they finally managed to catch up with and stop the horse. Well, that's all for today. Like the video if you enjoyed it, and let me know which one of these videos just blew your mind. I can't believe a horse was eating a chicken. That was probably the one for me. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, and uh, we'll see you next time.